So growing up in Germany, I was always interested in science. And then I went to school trip, which was really interesting. And we went to a Max Planck Institute, which was in the neighboring city. And that's where they do um, a lot of different kind of science. But one of the experiments we got to see there are the uh, models that they use are the axolotls, which are the animals that can regenerate, which means if you can cut up an arm or a tail, they can actually regrow that. If you're not a scientist, you're seeing that as a school kid, you're like, wow, this just blew my mind. I'm like, this can be actually a job, trying to figure out how to regrow organs. And that's how I really got inspired to do science. But I always had a bit of an interest in not just doing biology, but I also was into physics. And I wanted something that's a little bit more inspiring. And the heart has electric activity, so you have your physics. It is a very functional organ. And, um, well, it is required to live. I found a lot of labs that were interested in heart research, but more basic heart research, but really studying regeneration or using cells to fix broken hearts. That is something very new. The exciting thing is I'm just starting out. I have a whole career ahead of me. I have like 30 years of work ahead of me that I can spend doing research. And my goal is to eventually, hopefully, have made a cell type and to really develop the biological pacemaker that can go into people one day.